can we make this video look better? Let's try this. Oh, way better, huh? I'm going to tell you how, so let's get into it. Salam my friends, I'm Nima and welcome to a brand new video here on my YouTube channel Nemo TV where I post lots of video editing, photo shooting tutorials and also vlogs and tech reviews. So if this is your first time watching my videos, make sure to hit that ravish subscribe button and like and turn on the bell notification so you're going to be notified the next time that I'm posting a new video here on my YouTube channel. And if you're not following me on my Instagram, make sure to do that. Anyone who's into videography knows that lighting is everything. Even if you don't have a high-end camera, if you set up your lighting correctly, you can get a really decent quality of the video. So, a couple of weeks ago, folks from Pixel got in touch with me and they were willing to send me their latest RGB pocket light, which is Pixel G2. And I've been using this pocket light since then and I'm going to share with you my honest opinion and the use cases that I've been having for this. Like, you see this? This is that RGB light. So, let's do an unboxing first. What do we have in the box? I'm going to take out my knife. All right. There we go. Okay, there is a tiny box inside this. Let's see what do we have in it. Uh, okay, the papers that we don't read, the USB-C cable, oh uh, yeah, this is really good quality. Okay, let's put it aside. What else we have? We have a tripod, we have the co-shoe mount, which you can use to just put stuff on it or put this on stuff. All right, it has a bag and let me take out the actual Pixel G2. Mm. Actually, this has a really good quality, so let's see what else it can do. All right, so now that we know what's in the box, let me show you how this RGB light actually works. So I'm just gonna grab mine from here. All right, so I set it up on this color. It has a display on the back side. Good thing about this RGB light is the fact that it comes with the tripod and also this holder it lets it kind of move freely the way you want it you can mount this on your camera it has the cold shoe mounts one two right here there's also another hole for screwing stuff to it it has three buttons on one side a USB-C charger it has this display in the back you can see switch between different modes the brightness color temperature if you want to turn it on you just use this button over here I'm just going to turn it on. We have the display here. The brightness is on zero. I just increase it. Let's say on 50%. So it's on police mode. Uh, in order to change it, I just come down and then I just press. So this is normal mode. I can change my Kelvin, the temperature, the brightness. So it's just going to give me a warmer tone. And what else do we have? So if I click on this, I have the RGB mode. This is the brightness okay i'm just gonna put it on 100 and then i'm just gonna go lower and change the color okay you see i can switch between different tones the brightness levels and to change the saturation you just go all the way down and just reduce this so this is saturation i increase the saturation so saturation the color and the brightness so this is tv screen simulator so if you want to just simulate and just sit in front of it, say I'm watching TV for videography. So we have SOS, we have RGB fast changing, RGB slow, we have fire truck, ambulance, police again. So these are different modes within this FLS. So if you're recording your videos in your room in a tiny studio or you're constantly like traveling on the go and you want to light the environment, the room that you are like in a hotel room to just set it up and get some backdrop lights. This is a really good choice because first of all it's cheap, it has a really good quality and you have lots of choices to switch between based on your needs. So I would definitely be using this uh, when I'm traveling and wa I want to kind of record some video or take a photo like when I need extra lighting. Oh my god, this thing is really powerful. It's just 
Okay, so guys, uh, I put the link for this RGB pocket light below in the description. There's also a discount code that you can use to get it for cheaper price. So let me know below in the comments if you had any questions about this product. And as always, thank you for watching my videos and I will see you in my next video. Mochles.